New tonight, have you seen Joanne Dudek? It's the question that her family and law enforcement have been asking for some time. Tomorrow will mark one year since the Anthem woman disappeared. Tonight, family and friends came together seeking answers. 12 News journalist Jonathan McCall was there and has the story. Tonight, the family of Joanne Dudek says there are still so many unanswered questions about her disappearance nearly a year ago. They say that some of the things that don't add up, she would not have left her phone, her wallet, and her car all at her home where she was last seen. And they say that while they are not giving up hope in their search to find her, they know that with each passing day without her coming home, the news will likely be grim. You are my sunshine. Joanne did not disappear on her own volition, and that people do not just get up and completely disappear off the face of the earth. For 365 days, the family of Joanne Dudek has felt... Is that I'm mad, I'm broken, and I feel cheated. November 13th, 2022, Joanne last seen in her Anthem home. The next morning, she was gone. Her family says her phone, wallet, and keys still at that home, and she hasn't been seen since. Sunday night, her family, friends, and neighbors coming together to pray and search for answers about where she could be. Joanne, you are the first person I think about when I wake in the morning, and the last person I think about when I close my eyes. Her niece, Erin, keeping this case from turning cold. In late January, early February of this year, Joanne's case was turned over to homicide detectives. The Maricopa County Sheriff's Office not confirming to 12 News if the case is now with homicide detectives, only saying it's awaiting examinations on test results. Family members call Joanne a loving mother, friend, and the life of any gathering. They say at the time of her disappearance, she was planning a trip to see family on the East Coast. Now they're planning for the grim reality of what may have happened. We really leave here with more questions than answers. The Maricopa County Sheriff's Office is handling this investigation. If you or anyone that you know may have information on where Joanne Dudek could be, you're urged to give them a call. We're in Anthem tonight. Jonathan McCall, 12 News.